Hey everybody and welcome to Stock of Buildings. I'm going to be covering Amazon Prime Day, just some of its basic features and how it's affected its stock price in the past. So make sure to subscribe to this channel and comment below your own input on regard in regards to Amazon Prime Day. How do you think it might affect things? You know, what you're most excited about maybe with the deals and everything going on. But we're going to hop right into it here that uh, it's going to be running from October 13th to October 14th, pretty much running a lot of different deals. You got spotlight deals, you got trending deals, you got deals and gifts, brands on their own Amazon devices. You have lots of different categories to switch to. You have, of course, the standard lightning deals. You got deals on home stuff. You got Prime deals by a given category in different fashion. A lot of other discounts going on all at once. Something that they also have here going on is Amazon Live, kind of talking about different products that are being featured. Kind of a new thing that I don't recall seeing last year's Prime. I could be mistaken on that. You got spotlight deals and a lot of other stuff going on concurrently. But the most important thing to keep in mind here is based on their previous Prime Day uh they sold quite a lot, and then even in Black Friday and Cyber Monday, they sold even more on top of that. I don't know how Black Friday and Cyber Monday are going to kick into gear coming into this upcoming year, but Prime Day should be pretty good because they're likely going to get more sales based on that Prime Day impact than they're going to get for all those holiday sales into the near future. But that's kind of hard to say, and it's subjective, because this is the first year, basically, for Black Friday, so money and all that kind of stuff, that everybody's going to be at home shopping instead of in person. They're never, there's going to be a much less in regards to physical sales as there's going to be digital sales. So they might actually see a, even a more surprising earnings in the coming weeks, months, just thinking of it on that factor, I think that Walmart and others are going to take a bit of a hit, but Amazon's going to have a bigger boost from that aspect. They're already trading a pretty high here at the moment, which I'll get into here just in a second. But, you know, there's a lot of different deals going on. So just from that aspect alone, there's still benefit to you as an individual that you can maybe scalp something for eBay or whatever, or for yourself if you wanted to save a little bit of monies. Just something to keep in mind. Uh, but uh, essentially the other thing worth mentioning here is that Amazon's changing their boxes. They're going to have little pumpkins on them. Not all that exciting about it, but it's something that might be unexpected for you. So if you're you know excited about that kind of stuff, something worth mentioning. I don't think it's going to affect your sh the share price at all. I don't really think it's going to affect much of anything. It's just kind of a neat little thing that they're doing for Halloween here. And then, of course... Uh, if you draw on the pumpkin and scan a nearby QR code with the phone's camera to see the pumpkin drawing sort of come to life through the magic of augmented reality. So that's kind of a neat thing that they're adding to it. Not a whole lot of action on it. You know, overall, Amazon's kind of flat for its Prime Day. It did go up, but I wouldn't consider being up basically just $11 a share as much. It took a plummet here into uh, towards the end of the day. Not quite the end of the day yet how it's going to react, you know, coming into the days, weeks, months to come. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Just turned red as I was actually posting this. Apple, of course, here taking a big hit too with their event. You know, not a lot of new stuff really mentioned for them. Won't get into too much with that. Google taking kind of a hit sort of, but it's more or less flat on the day. Uh, the ultimate answer with, you know, Prime Day is... Is there a lot of uh, potential for upward mom momentum? Yes and, and no. Amazon is promising, but I, I feel that a lot of the fact that it was already expected, much like you know Apple's phone day, they're not going to have that big of a reaction to it. There's still going to be a lot of money flow. I'd say that in a swing or long capacity, when the earnings actually come in, when we see the data for you know Black Friday, when we see the data for Cyber Monday, however they're doing all that kind of stuff, when we see the data for the prime sales coming here into the next quarter uh, for their reporting earnings, that's when we're going to really see an impact. I don't really see much of a short-term impact because right now, a lot of that's still speculative. I guess we'll find out what really will happen into the near future, but there isn't really a whole lot to say about it at this point. Amazon Prime obviously going to bring in a lot of sales. 
maybe more so than they ever have before, considering this is the first prime day that they're doing where all the major retail stores are more or less still kind of closed or you know more reserved and people are more scared to go out things like that so just something to consider when you are looking at amazon stock price and all that fun stuff that there is promise for it into the future i wouldn't say that amazon is going to go bust or anything like that i think they do need to split at some point they're going to be struggling to break much higher i get that they're trying to you know collectively have that mass appeal of a more pricey share price but it's getting to a point where it's a little bit too pricey. Even a you know a one third split would be good, but I guess we'll see what happens into the future. Feel free to comment below your own input on Amazon and what you think it might do in the future. I'll be doing other videos, more detailed videos. I just wanted to get out a quick video about Amazon Prime Day and all that kind of fun stuff for you guys. But uh, thanks for listening in. Make sure to comment below your own input, and I'll see you guys later on.